Hi Gemini, it's Be Divine and welcome to Divine Miracles. And this is a very quick up update for the week coming ahead. And I'm going to be using the Conscious Spirit cards and also the Green Witch Tarot to give us a little bit of an overview in each area of your life, uh, what's going on for the week, okay? So again, like I said, this is just very quick and uh, we'll be doing more readings every day, of course. Okay, Aquari uh, Aquarius, Gemini. <laughs> Just did Aquarius, that's why. Gemini, what can we tell you? Okay, so Gemini, the third eye chakra. Interesting. Okay, I see the wisdom of my higher self and I apply this wisdom in my life. Gemini, you're getting a lot of uh, clairvoyance happening and you know it can come through feeling so your seeing can come through feeling okay so i want you to pay attention to your feelings this week feelings before you go to sleep little visions that you have before when you close your eyes etc um, and bring yourself into um, a knowingness you know that you do have wisdom flowing through you and your abilities are open especially at the moment your third eye if you're wanting to work on your third eye and open this up more completely and perhaps work on some psychic exercises, please get in contact with me. I have a, um, you know, psychic abilities, um, little course that we do, empowerment, etc. So if you wanted to learn some different exercises to help open all of this and empower yourself, let me know. But pay attention to the signs. They're there all week. Okay, don't distrust these things. When we, when we don't listen to our instincts, that's when we get in trouble. Okay, Gemini, what else is there for you? You have the six of Athames. Oh, that's nice, Gemini. Okay, the three of cups, fantastic. Oh boy, what a great week you're going to have, Gemini, and the Queen of Athames. Okay, Gemini. Let's do this for you. All right, so first let's start off with the um, Six of Athames, which is like the Six of Swords, okay? So you head on this journey alone, okay? You're doing a journey alone. You're traveling at some distance for some of you. But for others, you know, you're getting away from a whole lot of issues, a whole lot of drama, right? You've turned away. This is the end of Saturn being in retrograde, the beginning of it being, you know, moving direct. It's, it's, it's you know, 9, 19, 19. It's just like really positive energies as I'm doing this now. So continue to move forward, okay? Don't let anything or anyone hold you back right now, Gemini. It's really important. Um, your third eye is telling you, right? Then you have the uh, three of cups with this energy. Okay, so the three of cups also showing a bird in the background. People raising their glasses, celebrations happening. And you celebrating your own victories and your own achievements. Something is going to get a little bit easier or some good news is coming forward for you. Of course, traditionally three cups can indicate engagement, um, you know, marriage, parties, celebrations as well, as well as three girls getting together for some reason, you know, or it can just indicate happiness like on every level. The cup is full, you're celebrating, this is amazing news, probably because you got rid of all this drama, right? Now, the uh, third card for Gemini is the Queen of Athames. Now, when this card comes up, in some people's readings, it comes up as somebody who is, if you're asking, is somebody causing trouble? Um, this would say yes. <laughs> you know, if you're asking, is there somebody who um, I should be careful for about? It's like, yeah. <laughs> so the Queen um, of Athames can get a bad rap. Um, but it's like someone who's by themselves or someone who enjoys being by themselves or just the energy that you need to be a little more or cool your jets a little bit, maybe just be a little bit more independent, doing what you want to do. 
um, you know, taking some time away, okay, that it's really important for you to do that. And you've seen that uh, anyway coming up um, in your card readings. Uh, in, in this one, yeah, sorry, in two out of the three cards you have uh, this bird. And I always feel like birds, of course, bring uh, good news, okay. There could be something troubling you at the moment, um, or there could be someone causing trouble for you or some issue at work. I'm kind of getting uh, some negative energy, but you're way on top of it, okay? Um, this can sometimes indicate divorce or separation from somebody um, uh, or that that's needed, like uh, maybe it's, a, it's, it's like a pulling away from friends uh, for some reason and going out on your own which is needed but can also bring sadness, all right? Don't dwell on the sadness, okay? There's too much happy stuff going on here and you should be really proud of yourself, Gemini, for how far you've come. So thank you for listening, Gemini, and uh, until the next time, many blessings. Bye for now.